Hey guys, what is up? Welcome to the vlog today. Me and Kadil have a bit of an oddball day today. It is our last day here um, in the apartment before we're gonna be gone for several days. So tomorrow's Christmas Eve and I have to work, so we're gonna go spend the night at my parents' house tonight so they can babysit for me tomorrow. And then Friday's Christmas and we're gonna be spending Christmas at my parents' house. So I've gotta pack for several days. Also, me and Kadel are going to take pictures together this afternoon. Um, one of my girlfriends that I know does really cute family pictures, so that's loud, Kato. So we are gonna go meet her in the park and get some super cute pictures of the two of us. I cannot wait. It has been so long since we've had pictures done and I'm just so excited to get some cute, sweet pictures of my boy and have some memories with him to share and save forever. I cannot wait, I'm so excited. So that's what we have planned today. I'm just trying to finish up some laundry and kind of get um, our bags packed and all that for the next couple days. You guys, Kadel is being so extra right now because I had to wash his hair because I was trying to get him ready for this little mini photo shoot that we're going on and he's being so dramatic about it. I made a decision, we're getting a cut. Next week I made an appointment, we're gonna cut his hair. I absolutely love Kadel's beautiful, luscious locks. He's got like the most perfect curls and I hate to do it. Like I feel like I pull a new back muscle every time we have to wash his hair because he's just, he doesn't like it. He doesn't mind me fixing his hair, you know, like brushing it and putting the, the gel in it and the mousse and all that stuff. He doesn't mind that part, but for some reason washing his hair, he absolutely hates. And it's getting worse as he gets older instead of better. So I think I'm just gonna have to say we gave it a nice try and I'm not fighting that battle anymore. So we're gonna get a cut next week. Okay, you guys, I am just a little bit stressed out, not gonna lie, because first of all, I am like sweating from all of that bodybuilding that I was doing lifting y'all's packages. Totally hysterical. And seriously, how amazing are you guys? I mean, y'all never fail to amaze me with all of y'all's generosity. I have no clue what's in these boxes, but I do know one thing, is gonna be so pumped to open them on Christmas Day. So that's that. Um, Kiddo's just being a little bit difficult today, like not, not in the sense of, you know, he's like having meltdowns or like nothing crazy. He's just being kind of difficult. Um, just kind of like whiny a little bit. He went to speech this morning and he did so amazing for Miss Jill, his speech therapist. Like, I mean, totally on point, totally focused. He did so good. And then I think he just got bored with me, you know, trying to pack and do laundry and get ready for our photo shoot, um, which was totally for nothing because like literally I was sweating at the post office and my hair is like, flat and we're running late and I don't even know if we're gonna make it or if Kiddo's gonna cooperate. So it might just be a trip to the park with no pictures and that is okay. If it doesn't work, it doesn't work. Um, I know this girl through mutual friends, the photographer, and she's like so sweet. So I'm sure if Kiddo's not having it, I'm sure she'll reschedule. So no big deal. We're gonna, we're gonna give it a try. That's all we can do.
right, you guys, we have made it. We are at Ronnie Van Zandt Park and we are hopefully gonna get a few cute pictures. That's all I want, honestly. Even if it's just a few cute pictures of Kino, that's all I care about. We're gonna have a great time. Wow. We're gonna get some super cute pictures. Which swing do you want, buddy? to the zip lines. Buddy, that is a little scary. <laughs> you are such a goof, kiddo. You're such a goofball. <laughs> All right, you guys, that was absolutely amazing. Kendall did so well. He wasn't really feeling it at first. You know, we kind of had to improvise a little bit, but once we got on the playground, he was having so much fun just in his element and his environment, and she captured, you know, so many great moments of Kendall just living his best life, doing what he does on the playground. So that was really cool, and I'm so excited oh. to um, get the pictures back. I can't wait. Are you happy you got mommy's phone? You're swinging on the swing. Set. <gasps> Go. Okay, guys. So Casey, the photographer, is actually um, sister-in-laws with Jacqueline. So if y'all saw the interview that I did uh, about a month, month and a half ago with Jacqueline, she's one of my girlfriends. She does my eyelashes, and she has a special needs son, Levi. So I did a little interview talking about, um, you know, her experience as a special needs mom. And I've always noticed that Jacqueline has the cutest pictures on like Facebook and Instagram. She gets the best, um, you know, like candid family photos with her kids, and it's just so adorable. So Casey, her sister-in-law, does her pictures for her. So I reached out to Casey on Facebook to see if um, she wouldn't mind getting some pictures of me and Kidel, and she did so awesome, you guys. Like, just so comfortable with Kidel, kind of took his lead. You know, he really, we were trying to get some cute, like, woodsy pictures, and he was not super enthusiastic about it. So she took his lead and went to the park and got some, like I said, some super cute pictures of him just in his environment and doing what he loves to do. So I am just, thrilled I can't wait to get these pictures back but um if you guys are in the Jacksonville area if you have special needs kids and you know sometimes it's hard to find somebody that is comfortable you know kind of like vibing with special needs or you know going off their energy um interacting with them things like that well she did amazing and if y'all are in the Jacksonville area and you, you want um, a good family photographer that is super comfortable with kids and with special needs. Definitely hit her up. Um, you know, you can message me for her info and I will be happy to share it with you because she just did absolutely amazing. Oh. <laughs> Bubby, it's getting dark out here. What do you think? You want to go head on to Big Guy's house? Grandma's house? Okay, well it's getting dark outside, so we're about to wrap it up here, but thank you guys so much for watching and hanging out with us during this experience, and we'll see y'all next vlog. Have a Merry Christmas. Bye.